To the fullest, all the way from Long Island. Hey, and it's your, it's your right boy, here. Bayou Boy. Anything you need on this earth, I swear to God, he gonna get it for you. So you might as well hit that boy up. I don't give a damn what it is. That boy, WWE, I need money. Yeah, I need money. My cash up gonna be in the dollar. My cash up gonna be in the dollar. Come on, let's do two five. Let's do two five, y'all. Follow me on Instagram. That's go Lena or go underscore Lena. G E A U X. Uh huh. You know, trucking company, Colorado Enterprises, hit me up. Talk here. Talk here. Big shit. Come on, Mr. Red. Now, who's my turn? Yeah. It's your turn. Come on. Hey, look. Go ahead. You just started talking, man. Hey, now, one person spoke for themselves. Right. No, man. Like, that's what I'm confused on. Listen, I hear everybody. It's like, damn, I'm confused. Hey, because that's what we hey, do. Well, listen, man. I'm really, really, man. Uh, King's Landscaping. If y'all need landscaping jobs around the Houston area, man, y'all don't know. Look, up, look us up on Instagram, man. King's Ooh. Landscaping. Yes, sir. DJ, yes, yes no. Come on, hey, DJ. The last, huh? but not least, huh? King huh? Davis. The man, the, the man. milk. You heard me, the legend. You said Davis, man. Your favorite drop. With your favorite brand, dude. No, it's your love. No, we don't. Hey, the bull way, you heard? Hey, what's up? We take the shot. You gonna take a shot? Yes, Lord. And we also shouting out. Take the shot, VR, you heard me? So everybody take a shot and salute. What's up? I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Yeah, no bullshit. That's gas. <laughs> That's gas for your ass right there, boy. God. Now you take my shit off. Now y'all, let's take another shot just to get started. No, 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 no. Let me introduce ourselves. I'm gonna be a bullshit. I'm a bullshit. I'm a bullshit. Oh, man. Hey, no way. Hey, 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 she didn't die back there. Listen, man, that shit's crazy. We gonna leave that. Hey, shout out to Tito. Y'all nasty them motherfuckers. Hey, nah. I'm so fucking upset. Hey, for real. All right, take a clap. Take a clap. Take a clap. Yeah, I'm sorry, bro. You got some stuff out? Nah, go ahead. Shut the fuck up. Give me some brandy or some Skittles or something. Hey, man. Oh, that's oh. Drink, so. oh. <laughs> what y'all got with Tito and Jay? Damn! <laughs> oh my lord! This is all like under hey, my hey. nostrils. Any of y'all want to have a celebrity crush? No. A celebrity crush? I don't know, but it's about change. That's just what I'm saying. Hey, believe it or not, I already is. But believe it or not, I see I'm not your average. I ain't got all these fine Jamie Foxx. That's my mother. Yeah, that's a good one. You heard me? I'm married. 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 I'm married
And now it's going to be good. Like, 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 but then she got with milk, so you were like, you know, I kind of, you know, crib milk, it was like, no, nah, I can't fuck with milk. You know what I'm saying? So I ain't going to go. But then, then I, I kind of had it. I ain't going to lie to you. I might have been. But I kind of had a finish with Tiffany Haddish being right today. And then she just, she went sideways on me. Like, all that day. Like but you know, my all-time yeah, favorite yeah, is Alicia yeah. Keys. Ain't nothing top Alicia Keys. I'm yeah, yeah, I don't feel, I'm not buying them. I don't know. Oh, she got a little something about Oh, she got a little No, she got a Listen, when you come to Erica Bach, I'm going to tell you this, G. Oh, Erica? I was Erica. 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 The question. Oh, Me, I'm, oh, I'm gonna answer the question. Oh. I'm gonna tell you right oh. now. He said Erica Badu. This is my thing. Erica Badu. Erica Badu. Erica Badu. Hey, Erica, what's up, baby? I love Erica. Hey, listen. Erica Badu, she ain't gonna. You ain't gonna want to drink her bad boy. She gonna make you drink her bad boy. That motherfucker turn everything crazy and shit. Then touch her. You put your piece in her, you gonna become a Grammy nominated nigga, but you gonna go crazy. Like, my nigga, my nigga, Andre, you playing for? Oh no! Hey, you playing for? That's, 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 that's a goat. That's a goat. That's one of the golden goose coochies right now. Me, goddamn, give me some of that. Yeah, I need the curtain. The goose is embarrassing moment of your life. I ain't gonna lie, the most embarrassing. Uh, most I'm talking the most. Embarrassing most embarrassing. Yeah, man, listen, I'm sitting there thinking, most embarrassing. Yeah. Yeah. What you got? I got a man, listen, I got, I got it, I got one. I got most one, Third yeah. grade, bro, in third grade, bro. Acting ass in class, man. I'm tired of David's Man, my grandfather came to the school high, bro. I thought she was sweet. Told that ass up. Talking about, man, that nigga slapped the cowboy. Sit up, man. And sit my ass back to class. Man, hey, everybody walking down the house. Ha, 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 ha. Oh, yeah, so now, that, uh, now one, the, the, most, I know one. the most embarrassing thing was me. I had all my keys in the car. <laughs> you what the fuck? Oh, we want to be the embarrassing boy. I had, I, listen, <laughs> I, I got four kids, bitch. <laughs> I, had, oh, wait, you said, I had, I had, I had all my keys in the car, oh, and yeah. I had the shit. No, no, I hate the shit, G. Hey, look, I couldn't hold it no more. I'm the type of nigga, G. I ain't gonna shoot on myself, Listen, and this on the internet, nigga. By the graveyard, nigga, I went shit on the grave car. I was there. I ain't even going to My kids talking about that to the day, G. Y'all ever seen how high? 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 Yes, man. Hey, that's my most embarrassing, G. Oh, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Why, why I had to be when I was in school? Well, what I did? My, look, when I was in school, stomach was hurting, right? Oh, and you know that one got a tendency to take a fart or the shit? A short, a short, we was in school. You know what I'm saying? And we had khakis. Check that motherfucking class. In class? <laughs> that motherfucker had a brow stain. I called mama. I'm okay, three periods too late, man. Three periods. I didn't even see it. 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 I
like pick his ass up. That nigga should be like, oh, mama. She didn't come until like third period. Now you know Papa Joe ain't coming in. Hell no. Who's going to come in, right? Hey, I'm going to tell you what made it so bad. Hey, I already know what Papa Joe is. Hey, y'all remember who the best of seats when you take the draws on, boy? It was. So I'm sitting in that motherfucker. It was. That was the worst day of my life. Did the seat get wet when you got up? Listen. <laughs> we sitting there, and I get up, and I look to make sure that it's like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's good. Well, I look. Boy, look. Look, the seat class was dismissed, and you know, you know, you had them hoes. You had them hoes that just lie about us. Fuck up. Ugh, <laughs> <laughs> somebody was like, shit. <laughs> I heard the fuck out of here. 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 One day, me and a homeboy ain't gonna do whatever with a shooting ball at the park. <laughs> stomach was hurt, right? And I was like, hey, bro. I'm like, shit, my stomach hurt. I'm gonna nah, just it. gotta keep drinking that. You'll get it. I swear to God, just keep going. Look, but take it out, take it out. Just keep going. Take it out. I'm thinking, like, my stomach hurt because I gotta throw up, right? So I'm like, man, look, I'm, I'm, I'm like, bro, we gotta go. You ain't throwing up? So I get in my car, we ride back. I said, bro, pull up, I gotta throw up. I threw up, and I shit it all over myself. Why your ass so loose? I don't know. <laughs> bro, I, I'm literally sitting on the car with shit all over myself, and throw up in the front. I'm like, bro. It's not, you need to know. Hold on, hold on. I'm like, bro, don't tell nobody. They're like, I got you, bro. But his ass. So look, I, I closed the front door, and I went to the back. Man, we'll bro, the the whole whole fuck fuck. Smoke, that's too many shit. Hey, 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 that that could shut down. I don't know who was. Hey, 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 Y'all can take that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, look, he, he got a lot of things. Yeah, we have a glass. Yeah, take his eyes. We gotta take what we can pour. Nah, wait. I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take it. Oh, me. They thought it looked great. Anyway, who had the most influence in your life? Oh, what you doing? You had the most influence. Oh, yeah, Nisi. I'm gonna say my big brother. Oh, that's what's up. My father. You wanna take it for the heat? Good. My mom and dad were strict as fuck. And he was all the way out getting away with shit. Jesus. This is mixed right now. So, I'm gonna say this one. This one. Bye bye. Why didn't you do that? Don't you worry about that. Uh-huh. You mean? I ain't gonna lie, keep it on it. Wait, Robert, why we can tell I was the most embarrassing moment? Shit, I thought we did. Did he come on with you? Yeah, y'all gotta let everybody else for us. We can ask both of them. Most of the floor, but I ain't gonna lie. Keep it on it. You know what I'm saying? It gotta be bro, be bro though. Rod Reek shit. Rod. That's what's up. Gotta be rough. We miss you, Rod. Rod, 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 you got you a lot of trouble, you got you talk to a lot of shit too though. Yeah, yeah. Like motherfucker, I ain't gonna lie. Yo, my answer's some shit. Well, them. See, two for the one, now. Yeah, yeah. It's like, it like we had, I had two brothers. Two big brothers, Rod and one. Nah, bitch, man, I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> <laughs> but it was, they hung around each other. Yeah, like. we were talking about it, yeah. My, my. Oh, uh, hold on. I think, man. I influenced my motherfucker self. <laughs> 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 this motherfucker. It was either me or the streets, girl. Hey, that's who raised me, girl. Hey, real still. I, I. I don't know. I don't know nobody I looked up to. Yeah. I always wanted to be the top motherfucker. Yeah. Why you talking to me? So, so, so I got, I gotta go get it. I gotta go. He said the same shit. Damn. Yeah. Hey, Mister, he ain't look up to me. <laughs> Whoa. What happened? 
Well, he's feeling the way nigga looking at him. But he want to be that motherfucker though. But I, I was yeah. that motherfucker. But he want he thought he was Red. Man, that, that motherfucker been in my house since he was fucking fucking out the womb. Shit. So Rob, what you say? I've been I've been, been grown since I was fucking oh, yeah, fourteen years old. You should do this in the morning. Yeah, I gotta go watch your podcast. Do so it through. I just watch the snippets. But no, real spit. No, real spit. No, real spit. Like I I ain't have nobody. Everybody that I had around me. I wanted to be better than you I know what I'm saying? That. Because of the fact that I was I grew up in a in a in a fucked up era. Yeah. And everybody around me either was was doing drugs or dealing drugs. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? And I was the only nigga that wanted to do sports. Right. That's why right. it took right. me till I was like 30 something years old to get a first tattoo, start drinking alcohol, and now look at me. So, but but also, but also, I could have seen back. But guess what? I had my own house at 15. I I, I owned my own car. You know what I'm saying? Taking care of two kids. You know what I'm saying? My own money. You know what I mean? I'm that nigga. So I wasn't. Hey, I had nobody to look up to. So that was it. You know what I'm saying? I can't look up to you. I look down to you because I'm talking to you. I am so gonna feel this alcohol. Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm gonna feel this alcohol. 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 And they always were doing something positive, man. Me so, huh? like he said, it was either the streets or doing the right yes. thing, man. He was doing, doing the right thing. So I looked up to that. Okay. I mean, granted, you know, other things I'm transpired. But see, it was all, he was always the one I wanted to be I'm better than. So, nice. see, I, I looked up to that kind of model for a while. Yeah. I mean that's that's love. You know what I'm saying? I, I can deal with that. You know, and also, you know, Rob was Rob was the truth for everybody though. You know what I'm saying? He showed motherfuckers how to really be a man. On some real shit. How to stand on business. Before before all this standing on business shit came about. He showed nigga how to stand on business. You talking about a jeep? Yeah, it's a jeep. B I to the grass house. He was there. He showed me like, no, that's my thing. Long time. Long time. Long time. Well, what about that embarrassing moment? You I see me. I did that. 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 Okay, so I want to share my embarrassing moment because I thought I didn't have one. But recently, for things. Nah, I did it in the store. Thank you. 
Stop and they, they got, no, I'm like, shit, what's that fucking smell? Right. Now you walking around the store. Oh, and shit. Smell it. Damn, what are you doing? I'm like, that's not no fucking fuck. Hey, man, next question. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hey. Hey, 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 so you decided that you would get your butt played with the day before you uh, shoot yourself? I did, okay. yeah. How old is that? Yeah. Fuck Why is you asking that question? You don't even know if it was for me or it was for somebody else. She said recently. She didn't no, say recently. recently. Right. Uh, I don't know what it means, though. You she didn't talk about that. No, she didn't say recently. That's what she talked about. That's what she talked about. But guess what? I don't, I, don't, I don't care about if it was another nigga. So let me tell y'all who I look up to. And I don't get offended, sis. I look up to you too. But I look up to my friends because I was raised in the hood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like with drug dealers. Oh, yeah, yeah. I was also ball head whole shit up. So, <laughs> with that being said, when I met my friends, like, for example, um, one had a mom and dad. <laughs> I just have like a parent, two parent household. And I thought it was a norm to get cursed out like bitch this, bitch that, motherfucker. You know, Wait, is it a norm to have a two parent household? It's not, but it's not norm to get cursed out as a child. I thought it was normal. Why not? It's not. I that, that, it was that's normal. normal. It's like, not. Like, yeah, I was always I called mean, a normal. Yeah, I mean, no. yeah, we say it. You're used to it. That's you being a product of your environment because it's not normal. That's normal. I cuss my kids out like that. I don't call your kids. You're 13 with kids, shut up. I just called my son. Yeah, that's a dude. He's like, 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 so when she was, come on smoke, I'm sorry. Come on, I'm sorry, she was much So with that being said, they influenced me real big to go to college and also self-respect. Like, I'm not your bitch. Nisi, okay, that's now it's Nisi's turn. This is not your show. It's not just you. I'm going to say, that's what's up, that's up. Matter of fact, didn't tell your parents to go. Just don't tell me you're saying you're saying too. I think they did a tweet. That shit at the same time. I had a Richie shit. I had a Richie shit. Hell yeah, just last year. Hey, 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 I 
do his thing. Tell your thing. What's your thing? But I'm gonna say, can I finish? Can I finish? Let me see, man. Wait, finish. So of course the women, they want to get their ass beat. Yeah, they want to get their ass beat. Right, Reese and Kiki. But my men in my life is all my men. All y'all. Oh, uh, thank you, Lisa. All my, all my, my brothers. Brother. All my brothers. You know what I'm saying? Even though y'all let me be a nigga, Red's the only nigga that came through and made me be a girl. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm feminine. I'm feminine. I'm feminine. I'm just saying, y'all let me be a nigga. I didn't even notice that. She said that today. She said, oh, I saw Lisa on Instagram. She's so feminine. Man, shout out to Red. Shout out to Red.
nigga like that. That's a clear shot. That should be getting like slurred. Right, man. Slurring, that's a that's golden shot. Hey, no, it ain't. It ain't golden. It ain't golden. It ain't golden. They said when you swerve, that's really thick. You can't call it Terrio, bro. They need to walk around for eight periods. He loves this shit. And it's four periods. And it's four periods. Question, bro. Hey, come here. Damn, Terry, get all the good questions. Okay. Everybody is not answering, Robert. Everybody ain't answering. What you got? Oh, what was the question? Well, what would you do in the bedroom? What would you not do in the bedroom? What you not going for in the bedroom? Oh, boy. Hey, we do everything. Oh, man, I got it. You say Elsie just fucked. I don't know, man. I don't like booty shit. Like, don't stick your thumb in my booty or nothing. I know, but you can't break your cup to try it. Yes, you did. No, she did. She said, said whale. She, said, she, she said whale. The second time I said elephant. 
We ain't this the second time just going around. Okay, no, that's third. No, it ain't. I'm on the same time. I'm on the same time. I was one time. Right. That's all I said. I said that. We're going to start over. Shit. Can't So, wait a minute. We're going to start over the same day. Same day. We already had it. Man, what else? That shit's great. All right. 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 Well, how? Alligator. It was what? Arlena, come on, man. Yeah, I said, fine. She was in the alligator. I'm looking at her like, see, so on, so on. Go. You think it? Come on. Nah, I did it because it's long ass. All right, come on. Monkey. Giraffe. Flamingo. Snake. Bell. Crocodile. Seal. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. Hold that little fucker. All right, let's do that. Okay. If it was ever time when you couldn't get your stuff up, take a shot. Always remain that time, including the person name. If it was ever a time and you couldn't get your piece up, you were limp. Oh, I ain't no nigga. Shit, I'm gonna say that. Take a shot. Hey, explain that time. Cheers. And the person name. <laughs> I said, Keep going. Cheers. You I got to take a side of If you don't want to explain it, if you don't want to say the person's name, I can't even tell you the bitch's name, but I don't know the motherfucker. Yeah, I can tell you. I can tell you. Take your side. You got to explain. Yeah, go ahead. Take your side. Oh, you ain't going to tell the name? Take your side. Okay, you think What about you? You want to explain? I had no way to time. I don't know what that's about. I was like, oh, who? Yeah, like, <laughs> oh, that's a biased question, though, because the women ain't got no kid up. That's why it's on us. Yeah, so, yeah. so what I got yeah. to do? Oh, we, 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 we doing a podcast right now. It's the family podcast. Come on, come on. Hey, we got his, his hand in your face. I mean, right if y'all couldn't get it up, I'm going to take a shot. Oh, okay. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Get the phone. Get in my name on that. Oh, bitch. Bitch. Oh, bitch. Oh, bitch. I'm going to take my name on that. Oh, bitch. Right my shirt. He just said my name on camera. So are y'all drinking because y'all couldn't get up? Who? I didn't drink. <laughs> well, she late to the party. If y'all can't get up, y'all need to watch xxx.com or Pornhub.com. That's what I'm going to do. Oh, yeah, y'all want women to do crazy things like them people on Pornhub? Pornhub. Pornhub. Oh, right. <laughs> what the fuck? I ain't gonna lie, my expectations are not what they cook it. Fuck with dick, baby, you waste my shit, man. Man, I ain't making you waste shit. You need to waste shit, man. 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 He's drunk already. 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 He's drunk he ain't got to take a shot to explain. He ain't got to explain all. I'll take a shot. These niggas ain't want to tell on their sales. I'm going to tell you. He gets bored. He's spicy. So her name is. Damn, what was that bitch's name? You're trying to. I can't tell you. I don't know. 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 Whoever I can't think of her name, right. but listen. So, so it was right, a, right. it was a two man mission. Right, right. Ooh. It was yeah, a two I man mission. Oh. You, you don't want to fail. Like it was a two man. Right. It was a two yeah, man yeah. mission. Right. A and 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 I was supposed to go. I was supposed to go in here and take on the friend. Because uh, right. I <laughs> persons I know. Person unknown, I can't see it. They right, name. Right, right. She look like Rasputin, did she? Nah, gee, that motherfucker smell like goddamn Sea World, goddamn. Ooh. I done dodged on one of them before. Oh, I done faked oh, this. Oh, I done oh, oh, it came up out this bunch. Uh -huh. Let me tell y'all this. Y'all be trying to talk about females. They be smelling like Sea World. Man, just chill, bro, chill. This ain't about you. But no, y'all. Hey, yeah, yeah. So it don't matter if it be us niggas or not, man. maybe she been with a nigga that made her smell like that. But so look, this wasn't the, the problem wasn't that she smelled like that. The yeah, problem was, was when she when you pull them drawers down and you see that little little black or brown strip right there in that truck. Oh yeah. I hit the door. 
Well, I hit the door. Well, it wasn't that my drone wasn't getting right. It wasn't gonna get right. I got out of there. I got out of there. Right, so that story yeah. ain't count, man. Yeah, that ain't what so it's so like. That, that is, and that's the only, any other time, nigga, it's off. I don't care. Man, it's the time you wanted to. Well, the time you could. You right there. You right there. You could. You right there. You don't want it. Like, you could. If this ain't happening, get that thing, and you just ain't get it. Just ain't happening. Because your buddy wasn't finna stay here. salute. So oh, it was this time, right? It was this time. Yeah. And listen, <laughs> Shorty sitting right here beside us. It oh, was this time. Oh, I went to the motorcycle event. What the fuck you just And I was at. I the, know what? Shorty sitting right beside us. Yeah, and, and listen, I was on live at the motorcycle event, and Shorty pulled up and wanted to talk about some crazy joy. And I said, man, I'm in a relationship, but I can't get it up. I, I can't do it. You can't get it up. I said, I can't do it. And you can't can't get, get it up. Yeah, that's the time that you wanted to. You misunderstood the question. So who is in a relationship with? That's a T.O. That nigga drunk. That's a T.O. Red. That nigga drunk. Hey, 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 that's what he just and you said. couldn't get it up. It wasn't that I couldn't get it up. I said, I said, no, no. I said, no. It wasn't that way. You saw it, but you said it Listen, man. He said, well. Arlene, he's not talking about with you. He just said me. No. no. I knew you missed it. No, that's all he said. You listen to the story. It comes to me. Next question. Come on, man. With you. But somebody else was trying to get him to get it up, but and he couldn't. He shouldn't even be in that fucking predicament if he's in the motherfucker. Oh, no, the fucker. I ain't having a baby. Hey, that's what it is. Right. See what it is. Right. Don't worry about it. Hey, ask your question. Hey, anywho, goddamn it. Let me answer the correct way, goddamn it. Thank you. Please. Hey, listen, man. It's all over. I guess I ain't answering the question right. Why would you even be in a position like that if you're in a relationship? But I'm not mad. I'm not mad. I'm a boss bitch. So that's why. We're going to talk about the time. I'm going to put another question. Yeah, man. That's it, man. Put another question. You heard the question. I heard you getting that. That was the question. I don't care. I don't care about what you're talking about over there. How about that? This is irrelevant. It sounds stupid as hell. What you heard? Look, you talking about it. Look, you talking about it. That ain't cool, man. Uh-uh, Dex. Don't just be throwing shit away now. Open that shit, bro. What is your definition of over? The relationship. Okay. That's a conversation. Only person in an open relationship is that. Well, 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 define your definition. Okay, define your definition of open relationship. I don't know. That's not like for poly shit. That's pretty much. I'm not. I'm, it's more poly than you. Y'all in open relationship? No. Yeah. Yeah. Oh no. Open relationship. <laughs> Two people. What's that, 
I mean, it don't, I, it don't make the female. I don't, want, I, don't, I don't really agree with that. I don't, I don't really agree with that. What? That that it depends on the person or or, or, or how to. So you expect it? I, I expect I expect that grown people. It's the same thing like they say. You gotta have your whole face, right? That's your whole face. That's what she said. They said that women. They said that everybody gotta have their whole face. Now sometimes. Sometimes motherfuckers just out here having fun. You know what I'm saying? Ain't even looking for a relationship. They just fucking on the first date. But no, no, no. But How that, do y'all that, feel that, about not just... Hold on. Well, but that'll be understandable. If, that's if, that's if you want to fuck, if you want to fuck, that's not a date. It's like, hey, look, we're going to be there, we're going to fuck. Yeah, but sometimes it's it, it end up, it, it, it start off as a date, but then it end up there. But see, it depends on the character of the female. That's to me. Well, the female does control. Yeah, the it's the character on. of the female. But then it's some females that got a high standards or high character that be ready to fuck before the ones that they got shit. Well, mm-hmm. 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 Each other. You know what, I'm what the female did? Yeah. Why y'all didn't bring nothing to eat? You taking shots? You got it right there. Yes. Look, you got a whole salad right there. Yeah, yeah you got a salad. You got to slow down. We ate all day. <laughs> I have a baby. Hey, how this was? Why you didn't ask me? Hey, it's all good. It's all good. Let it go. Oh, what? What's the question was? On the first, first date. Was, why do you feel about sex on the first date? I feel like the chemistry there, and you grown, and you want to do it, you protect yourself, you do what you want to do. Yep. So I everybody agree. Fuck protection. That's it. It's time about fuck protection. Fuck protection. Wait, 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 wait. Pause. Don't ask your question. <laughs> That's the question in his own. <laughs> so what you mean by? Fuck protection. Right, so, right, you tripping. Who said fuck so, protection? So, what, what, what makes you feel like... So, it, what, what gives you the, the knowledge to say that you don't Easy. want no protection? Oh, wait. Like, she what that question dick? was? Uh, she sucked the so dick. No, hold on, hold on, hold on. But that's her getting the disease, not you. Why I don't can't wait. Getting hit, but put on the condom. Hey, Tano. Hey, it's for everybody. What make you, uh... What's the shit where I say, uh... Comfortable. What make you, uh... Decide whether or not you want to fuck a girl, girl raw or not. Yeah, that's the question. That's yeah, that's shit hard. Yeah. It could be starting off with a condom. How is it? <laughs> <laughs> For real. Like, hey, so the question I, 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 what makes you want to fuck a girl raw or not? I don't make a female. What makes you want to fuck a man raw? So you make some bad decisions. I get what you're going with. Speak your piece. Speak your piece. Speak your shit. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you what i am going to tell you i am going to tell you what i am going to tell you i am going to tell you what i am going to tell you i am going to tell you what i am going to tell you i am going to tell you what i am going to tell you i am going to tell you what i am going to tell you i am so yeah. shit, it's, yeah. it's, it's yeah. halfway yes, I die slow. Oh, hold on. <laughs> halfway through this shit. Halfway through this shit, I'm thinking to myself, nigga, if I'm gonna catch something, I'll have caught that bitch already. You know what I'm saying? So shit, you talk to my wife. Hey, what you got? Hey, what you say? Hey, what you got? Hey, what you say? Hey, what you got? 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 Hey, don't be conservative because you know like you might like be real. See me? I'm different. Yeah, I'm going I'm gonna go crazy with oh, that condom yeah. regardless. I don't give a fuck how good the coochie is. I'm gonna go crazy <laughs> until we get to a point where we say that I right, we just I mean I don't think that's Okay, true. if you're using I'm the condom sure. though, are you getting hair from this person? With, with the condom on. Okay. No. Cause see, I'm the type. This, I'm the type that. I'm the type that. I'm the type that. Listen, Paul. I'm the type that. I'm the type that. I'm the type that. We not even finna go towards the hair part. I'm the type that. 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 I'm you ain't got to spend yeah. that too. My dick for me to fuck you. Right, exactly. If I want to fuck you, I'm going to fuck you. Right, that's it. Right. Call it a day. Walk out. Oh, you ain't got to do that. Hey, well, see, niggas that want their head, the 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 ni
How you, you smell the breath? What you, you smell the breath? Talk about it, Jesse. If you have a gum yeah. disease and have all that shit going on, you gonna well, smell it. Like man. Breath hey, the breath might be stinking, nigga. That's so you tell me, I'm gonna tell you, who the fuck the bitch was smoking, bro? Here's the problem with you, simple nigga. You the fuck the. Here's the problem with you, simple nigga. You the simple you the nigga that said. But you the one that said that. You the one that said that you ain't using the cum. Here's the problem. Here's the problem. The problem is, you motherfuckers can't see shit. No, yeah. the problem is I got four kids. Listen before I'm responding. Listen, Listen before responding. You don't see shit. So if you talk to a bitch, you gonna be like, all right, well, shit, this is just a fuck lady. You can't tell. You can't. Even, you don't look at this bitch teeth. You don't look at her tongue. Can you don't look at her red shit. Why she red? Why she red? Why she red? Why she red? So when we was in Biloxi, nigga, you was on go like like Damien in the bathroom, nigga. Hey, you was in there with motherfucking so phone books ready to go, nigga. So you ain't know nothing, you motherfucker, but you was so ready you to go. So you never just got here from a female? No, never. Never. On my little brother grave, you hear me? Never. Well, that's the I question, Terry. I didn't have a dick chew, but I didn't have no. a condom. You said chew. Never. Right. I done had that shit happen twice. What's going on? Boy, I had a condom on every day. And that shit was the hard worst thing. When it come down, listen, when it come down to me smashing a chick or getting some hair from a chick, nigga, I swear to God, I'm I'm bougie than a motherfucker when it come down to me fucking somebody. I like DJ. I ain't gonna lie to you. I'll pass over a piece of pussy before I got there and say, hey, anything. And that's on that's on my mind dudes. Right. Like I pay up, nigga. I, 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 I would talk to a motherfucker all night long and cater to him, bro. and then at the end of the day, I would not smash him. If you know him, bro, it's a different thing. <coughs> so like, nigga, if you right. comfortable with that person, put it like this, bro. At the end of the day, if you comfortable with that person, like if you know that person, comfortable with that person, then if you trust that person enough, <coughs> I mean, great. Yeah, maybe you might, you might, you might, might go, you might go with that, you might go that extra stick. But, yeah. but if some random, no. But see, listen. See, my problem is, listen. My problem is, though. So when you when you comfortable with a motherfucker, to my motherfucker, but listen. See, this is the problem, though, Reg. It ain't that you comfortable with a motherfucker if you smash a motherfucker on the regular. That condom gonna pop once or twice. You know what I'm saying? So you already fucked up. That's all. That's all. Right. 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 No, <laughs> what? So you telling me that you, you for so it, No, 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 no. I'm saying like you ain't gonna put one on at all. Like you, 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 you ain't gonna put one on at all. Not literally. Not gonna hey, you're you not gonna want it. Like you gonna be like, man, I gotta see what this shit feel like for real, for real. Like, I done fucked this bitch five times. I done fucked this bitch five times. This shit was a fail. Huh? That's what you wanna say. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Feel my so you saying that? So you telling me that you didn't fuck the bitch five or six times, and you telling me you don't really want to see what that coochie feel like now? Why well, wasn't been five or six times before you want to feel how it feels? <laughs> that was my problem. problem. Because I really don't know this bitch. Like I could have fucked up three days straight. Got me five or six times. <laughs> <laughs> are you just freaking? Are you just freaking? Are you just nasty motherfucker? You just nasty motherfucker. That's what it is. That's what it is. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I can't. That's like that's like that's like going to eat at a restaurant. And the motherfucker say, man, that bitch good. I say, oh, DJ, let's go over here to the kitchen. And the motherfucker say, yeah, that shit was good. They go back over there. You, nigga gonna double back to see what that shit. Man, man that shit trash this time, bro. It must be the cousin or something. You feel what I'm saying? But listen, listen to what I'm saying. Listen to what I'm saying. If you go to the true kitchen, if you go to the true kitchen, you say, you see, that shit good. And he go there, and they had cooked the shit. You think you were like, man, I really want to try and see how it really tastes. You're like, man, fuck you, kitchen. I don't like this shit. So what I'm telling you is if a motherfucker got a kind of the only thing she know for wanting to do is her imagination. Like, shit, I think that shit is really better than what it is. I would tell no. you what no, fuck See, no, no, what it is is. That i be quiet. No, what it is is, it ain't that, it ain't that imagination. That so when, a, when a chick gets some they good know, meat, when she get a good meat, she, she <laughs> gonna go, when she gets some good meat, she gonna go to her closest motherfucker that she talk to. That's what she gonna do. She gonna go to the closest motherfucker she talk to and say, man, that nigga gave me that yeah, you I ain't never did no shit. That means that I see the post on Facebook that motherfuckers gonna always run and say to their best friend, their sister, or, or whoever 
they got in their ear and say, man, hey, man, she gonna go try that shit again. What? I see a lot of more from the shit. Gotta be the ass. That's what I see on Facebook. But it'll be true though, man. Cause I'm, pr- I'm pretty sure eventually you fucking love more wrong. Listen, man. Everybody got their own way of doing whatever they do. Me personally, bro, just cause I fuck you two times, I don't mean I'm gonna fuck you the third time. We gotta come. No. No. Some people may go out that first time. Right. But that's what I said. Some people may. Hey. What's your favorite quote or saying? Your favorite what? Quote or saying? That you live by or some shit like that. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh. That's good. Can, can we can go on the table? Go on the line. We're going to go down. Why we can't start first? Go, 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 go down. Can the girls start first? Yes. Ladies first. Ladies first. Let's go. Your number one saying. Your number one line. The quote or saying that you live by. Ladies first. My number one saying I live by for my dad all money and good money. Hey, I like that one. I like that one too. I like that one And I got one more I too, y'all. And I got one more. Another one, um, I live by too. No, you can't do that. Because it might be mine. No, another one that my dad. That whole shit, that shit, that shit. Another one that I live by, my dad. Um, mouth can say anything. So you ever heard it? Mouth can say anything. So nigga be chopping up their mouth. Mouth can say anything. Hey, hey, yeah, shout out to Bam Bo. You're uh, uh, straight up across the train. You're uh, always moving. What about you, Miss? It is what it is. Facts. 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 Let the rest of the day play out and deal with it fucking tomorrow. Okay. You heard me? All right, well, we don't let this shit stress you out. What about you, Rich Rich? Look, I ain't got no saying, but you always hear me say right on with shit about anything. Yeah, it's right on with everything. See, right on. Like she said, it is what it is, man. Right on. So, uh, mine is, I got two of them. <laughs> I got two of them. A quick quarter is always better than a goddamn slow dollar. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Sell that thing. Hey, and my <laughs> second one is. You, you said it's better? Yeah. A yeah, quick quarter is always better than a slow dollar. Sell it. Elaborate, because I'm getting so close. Sell it. Better than sell it. So, 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 so a me, quick quarter. A quick quarter so, is so always better than a slow dollar. So what they mean is... I thought steady would be the slow dollar. So guess what? This, I got four... I got four cups right here. Well, I got four cups right here. That's a dollar, right? I got one cup right here. I can sell you this one cup faster than I can sell you these four cups for 25 cents. At least you're making some money than no money. And I see a four. So that's, that's what you get there. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's a quick saying. cup is faster. At least you're making some money. You know what I'm saying? And outside of that, my next one is it's only money. Don't fuss over, G. Yeah. It's life. It's the root of all evil. We'll get some more money. Come and go. Amen. I like that. It's only it's money. Just, it's it's only, only money. money. We're going to make it. We'll get some more money. Shit. You hey, man, 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 you weigh everything by the worst that it can be. Uh-huh. Ooh, and if the worst that it can be is not that bad. Then do it! Then do it! Ah, then do it. You know what I'm saying? That's so what I that's what I always went, that's my motto. That's how I live my fucking um, life. Like, my slogan is, this. this too shall pass. Right. So, like no matter it. what you're going through, no matter what's going on, hey, it's going to subside to this. But guess what, right. right. I want y'all to know something. Both of them shits I just said, I made that shit up. Yeah. <laughs> I ain't heard that nowhere. What's the best advice a family yeah, you ain't ain't ever gave you? Yeah, you ain't saying what you're saying. Oh, the rain can't last forever, man. Ooh, long that's that's good good man. Yeah. 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 Rain yeah. can't last forever. Yeah. Yeah. The sun come out. I'm going to say what Terry said. This too shall pass. Oh, me. What you said? What you said? What you Shit, I think everybody does the same. Shout out, what's the next thing? What's the best advice a family member ever gave you growing up? We start on this end, so start with Terry. Nah, that's the way we keep it on here. No, we always going to start with the girls because I don't keep it on here. No, we're going to start with the girls. 
My best advice per my pops, just live. Everything per her pops. Let's go. Are you having a bad day? Yeah. Are you guys just live? What was the question again? Uh, the best advice. Advice. Just advice. Just What's so the best advice you ever got from the family? Oh, I, I said it already. What? Damn. What I said? <laughs> <laughs> I did just answer. I said what Terrell just said. This too shall pass. No, this too shall pass. Oh, oh, I never told you that. that. Hey, shit, I swear daddy said that. <laughs> <laughs> 24 7. Shoot, <laughs> nigga, this too shall pass. Shoot. It's gonna pass. What you got? Shit, I'm gonna see what I got. Huh? Oh, I like I'll that. Oh, you'll see the rock. Oh, you'll see the rock. That's good. Yeah, you need it. So, Lonely or Lula Mitch, you heard me? She say, you gotta stop. You gotta die from something. Ooh, I like that one. See, right. I'm fearless, nigga. You know what I'm saying? I want to jump off the mountain. But you what only hope? promise two things in this life. <laughs> to live and to die. You was born and you died. You yeah. gotta die from something. You gotta die from so something. if it's the day of tomorrow, guess what? Hey, Do it me. might not be the day. I died three times. Fuck it. You did. Six. It I might not be the fall. Six. Three. Fuck it. Uh, you want to talk about it? I do want to talk about Whatever it. Whatever you read. It's on you. It's not man. Something somebody told me, man. Stand for something for five minutes. Ooh, yeah, Pop, Pops used to always say that too. Another one you used to say is, is um, let your life preach your funeral. Let your life preach your funeral. Hey, with that being said, though, can I, can I piggyback on that? That's a shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, all y'all family, this is a family podcast, right? right. This is a family podcast. I want y'all to know, I might die before all y'all, because I do some dumb shit. You said, all right. <laughs> That's me too. I do shit. Wait, this no. I ain't repeating it because I want all them to live longer than me. But so, at the end of the day, I don't want none of that old side ass goddamn everybody come up here praying and all that other shit. I want y'all to motherfucker have motherfucker. Goddamn in the background oh. singing songs the whole funeral, goddamn. Can and I, they say they stop praying more than five minutes? You tell them get on, get on down. Can I tell y'all what I want y'all to do? No, no, we're gonna do I want y'all to take my phone you and text everybody. She said boundaries. Oh, okay. So, you know, it's, 
It's Arlena. It's Arlena. It's Arlena. Arlena, you got your Well, it's pretty much the same what you guys just said. I used to learn how to say no. Like, I had a lot of family That's members always. I got to say no. Hit me up. When they need, I don't care if it's $20. I don't care if it's $50. I need to know what's going on. Yeah. Like, what's going on? 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 I had to change my um, cash shop name. Do not act because I got tired of it. I don't need to call it. Damn, and I, like so it. I had to learn how to say no and not feel guilty yep. of saying no. It, like, I'm not your mom. I ain't, you ain't my child. It's no. So that's what I had to learn. Right. I like this. What you got, dude? See this. See, it's trip no. I, I'm, I'm kind of building a little different. I don't know if it is 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 the Scorpio in me or, or what because my, my joint is my joint ain't, ain't based around like I don't know if I I don't understand why I don't I don't cater to to money so much or, or, or what I'm giving to a motherfucker so much because of the fact of. <laughs> Because of the fact, my my thing is you know the value of it. I, exactly, so it don't mean it don't it ain't worth shit. Right. You know what I'm saying? Even if you got a million dollars, it ain't worth shit because it, it it's a lot of me now. There's, there's, there's bitches. You know what I'm saying? Not, in, in a sense, not saying that they just you know uh, you know it's just the word itself. You know what I'm saying? Like it don't it don't hold no value because you a million now. You gotta stand for something. You know what I'm saying? So that don't that don't. So what's your life lesson? My life lesson was I ain't gonna lie to you. My life lesson was, I'm so used to moving fast. Hmm. Slow that ass down. You got to slow down sometimes. Yes, sir. And I'm enjoy, glad you know that one. And enjoy what you got. Yes. woo -hoo. And enjoy Lord. the small shit. Enjoy what you love. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, enjoy yeah. what you like to do. Because... It, I know I'm, I'm I'm kind of preaching a little bit because it 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 it's, it, it goes it goes it, it, it that shit that just hit me yeah, at home real real hard you know what I mean yeah, yeah. You know it. I ain't even know it yeah, because because it, it goes it, it goes with your demeanor so a lot of niggas be like man nigga I ain't no fucking follow yeah but then that shit put you right back in that follow category because now you feeling the same way another motherfucker feeling so now I guess who following who. You know what I'm saying? Or is it just a big ass, you know what I'm saying? Big ass drive towards the same same scenario. So you gotta be you, man. Don't let nobody change you or, or, or no situation change you. Point blank period, no matter what it is, you gotta be you because if you change any way of your course, you ain't you no more. You playing somebody else. True. You being somebody else. So that, I learned that shit the hard way. You know what I mean? Hey. It is what it don't matter if it, I don't care about that family situation or, or what it is, you know what I'm saying? It's just you at the end of the day. You was born by yourself, you gonna die by yourself. Family is family, you gotta love them. You ain't gotta care about them, but you gotta love them. Sometimes you ain't gotta love them, but you gotta be who you are. But you, you know what I'm saying? You know what it is. I'm glad you did that. Hi, sir. Nah, wow. that's with your business. Wow. Nah, wow. I don't like wow. your mind, bro. Wow. Like, I don't like how I like your things, though. It ain't what it is. One thing, you know what I'm saying? I always follow your good. You know what I'm saying? Follow your yeah. good. Yeah. Yeah. This thing ain't gonna leave. It ain't gonna lie to you. It ain't gonna lie to you. It ain't gonna lie to you. And the second one, I ain't gonna say I learned it. It's something the nigga still trying to learn. Mm -hmm. Talk like, about it. As, as a man, on some real shit. Talk about it. I'm gonna dealing with so much trauma and PTSD type shit. Yeah. That's you real. You gotta find an outlet, you hear me? That's real. Some shit I'm still learning. That's real. Find somebody to talk to, G. PTSD is real. Find though. somebody to talk to. I ain't gonna lie, Because if you explode quick, then you ain't gotta go to the military to go to your PTSD. You're speaking facts. You take it down. There's like a million things I could talk about for real. Like, do you think that was a trauma that you had to go through to get to where you are now? Yeah. 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 But yeah. my mine is, is is two core things is one is do your research. Yeah. Right. What I mean by that is well, we just use for instance credit. Right? Yeah. Everybody here could probably attest to their parents said don't ever get a credit card. No, no. Hell yeah. No. yeah. I can't get credit card. Yeah, go ahead, go ahead. Yeah. We we do get to talk about that. Well, not only just yeah. your parents or Anybody you look up to probably the test to don't get the credit card, mm -hmm. right? But if you do your research and see the value of having a credit card mm -hmm. or how to use a credit card, Facts. then you will understand, like, they just didn't know how to use it. That's just an analogy. Mm -hmm. Do your research on everything from religion to politics to how you move every single day. 
And another one is, and, and, and shout out boy, man. He said it best. I can't, I can't say it even better. Blood make you kin. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. The loyalty, your actions, that's what makes you family. And I think that's the, that's the biggest thing I learned in life. That is it. Like, sometimes you just you just born my cousin. Right. Yeah. You just born my auntie. And there's been aunties, I still say fuck you. Right. <laughs> so I'm, I, that's just, yeah. you just been dead honest. Yeah. Like, sometimes you, we're just born kids. Yeah. And that doesn't, that just, that don't make you family, that just makes you kindred. Yeah. And that's all it is. And I think that's the biggest thing. That's love. And I, I know, I mean, this is discussion, so I want to discuss it. Well, I'm going to say, no, you can discuss. Go ahead. No, I know brothers still got to do no, you know, So, 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 so it's like, it's like a, a tug of war between, that's the same thing. Remember, I was asking you about, you remember, we, you asked about the questions we're going to ask today. And I told you about questions from the ghetto and questions from the suburbs, suburbs, you know what I'm saying? So, at the end of the day, like he said, you know, people don't really talk about credit cards. Right. Because guess what? I ain't never know my mama to have no credit card. Right. You know what I'm saying? Not trying to put nobody in no fucking in no situation or nothing, but no all we knew about was drugs. We paid for everything in cash. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We ain't never had no credit card. So I ain't never had no credit card. I ain't never yeah. think about no credit card. Shit, I had a, a, a fucking phone bill in my name when I was 12 years old. You know what I'm saying? And I ain't even know it. You know what I'm saying? Shit, you feel what I'm saying? So, so, so at the end of the day, it's like, you know what I'm saying? You grow from real shit, but guess what? My mom do say, ain't never let, hey, ain't never let me wrong, and she ain't never let me go without. You know what I mean? Well, it ain't even, it ain't it's just stipulations, and, and, and it's, it's, it's stipulations of, of where you live and, and how you all grow certain situations. Well, right, but that's true. But also, what I'm talking about is, it's not saying that your mom doesn't even have intentions on doing it. I'm pretty sure she didn't have intentions. But she probably don't know, like you said, she didn't Cause think it wasn't to her. school. Right. right. But it wasn't talk to her. So what I'm telling you is she can only tell you on what she know. Right. right. Right? So if she didn't know the benefits of a credit card, she didn't know good credit score, what that'll do to you. She didn't know how to build an empire and stuff like that. How can she pass it down to you? That's right. right. That's what you're so, saying. And that's, that's what I'm telling you. That's what I'm attesting to. That's what I'm saying. So I was using that as an yeah. analogy. Right. So what I'm saying is do your research. Yeah. Learn that yourself. And that, that's why Don't I said I just wanted to pick it back I wasn't what you raised. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you so said it right. So don't use like, I wasn't raised yeah. this way. I don't know how to do it. Man, we live in a day and age where you can snap your fingers and look it up on the internet. Yeah. And, 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 right and the thing about it, that's what I'm saying. I, I'm not trying to, I'm not saying that you're wrong. I'm saying that you're right. Because no, no, I don't I'm say saying that. That, that it wasn't given to me to give to somebody else. You know what I'm saying? Now, now that I see it myself, man, listen, I don't care. I know all of us are staying right. I ain't trying to say nobody literally about anything, but I think I know more about a computer than anybody at this motherfucking table. You yeah. know what I'm saying? But at the same time, I know less about a motherfucking mean goddamn credit card or credit than anybody at this table. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Because I pay for everything with cash. That goes back to that same analogy that I told y'all. Quick quarter is better than slow dollar. You know what I'm saying? Because all I know is about fast money. I get it in and get it gone. You know what I'm saying? That's it. I pay my bills and I, I, I move on. You know what I'm saying? I ain't worried about what I gotta worry about on the back end. Mm. It's everything on the front end. No I, I got you know another. I got another one. He said that we're going so, to. So it's on the. It's everything that's in front of me, and not you know what's it. behind me. So now I'm generating. No, I'm, well, I'm, I'm trying to work towards. To I'm trying to work towards generational wealth so that my kids know about credit. All right. Then my kids know about business. Now I don't, you know what I'm saying? Form something different. You know Let saying? me say this before you move on. And this is just a little statement. I know. Uh, the I'm second gonna, thing I'm that I learned, and, I, and I'm preaching it to everybody, stop saving and invest. That's that's the big. That's the outside the family and stuff like that. That's the one I'm preaching the most. Is stop saving and invest because a lot of people are saving to save. Just say you got money in your account, and that'll be gone tomorrow. I mean, but, but wait, you build your residual income. That is kind of that. That is kind of a hard spot. Yeah, yeah. Because, yeah, yeah, yeah. because I mean, entrepreneurs. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Uh, I can answer. I can answer, but go ahead. Ask the question. So I feel like this. When it comes down to saving, I'm going to put like this. I'm going to put like this. Let me block all this shit out. So when you said stop saving and invest, all right, cool. No, I said I stop saving to save. Yeah, and invest. Okay. okay, okay. Now that's a different thing. Right. 
Cause, but I'm gonna say this though. Yeah, I get it. Hey, there are rainy days. Yes, but see, right. so when you need to save, you're saving. But no, no, for a rainy day. Right. He didn't, say, he didn't say say. He didn't say say for a rainy day. Say say. Right. Save. Stop saying right. 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 So that's what I'm saying. Okay. I'm, that's, I'm clear. I'm clear. I'm clear. Right. Clarifying, well, it. Me, clarifying it for the niggas out there that don't. Well, for the people out there, let me quickly. That don't understand. No, listen. Okay. Hold on. Yeah. You yeah. said you ain't nothing wrong. With, ain't nothing wrong with what you said. I'm just clarifying it for the people out saying. there that don't understand what he just said. Yeah, right. Saving yeah, yeah, yeah. for a rainy right. day is quality. Oh, that, that's, that's mandatory. Oh, yeah, that's mandatory. The Lord yeah, knows yeah, I had a lot of rainy days, and thank God that I did save because it came in handy. Mm -hmm. But saving just to save, it is bullshit. Reason being, I have a life, life insurance policy. That motherfucker is in some normals. You heard me? And my kids, if I pass away, each one of them going to be in some normals. So I'm not saving to save anymore. Because I understood, like, man, if I die, nigga, I'm sitting here saving for these niggas. They're going to get my savings. Oh, and they're going to get my own uh, life insurance policy. They're going to do what the fuck they want to do, no matter how you raise them. So, shit, I might as well just give y'all my own um, life insurance policy. And my savings, I'm not about to sit here and take my whole life. Just to work and say, and just to work, 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 all the way, just to save. That makes no sense so, to me. So, so I'm saving only for a rainy day. Yeah. Hey, and but hey, have you ever had a life changing moment? Yes, so. What it was. Have you ever had a life changing moment? You can turn down for questions, because, man. It's on you. Nah, you Fucking right. Fucking right. Man, listen, Wait. all these ass life. <laughs> I can get, man, listen. We need a podcast by ourselves, because right. I give you answers to all this shit. Man, fuck. But this bitch be going for yeah, hours. Yeah, yeah. The fact that I didn't know you could be 20 something years old and have a stroke. Right. Like, no, for real. That changed. I thought I was Superman, like, shit, fuck. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, for real. I thought, like, man, look, I, I was like, man, oh, well, <laughs> eat what you want to eat, do what you want to do. Look, I took COVID for a joke. It was like, man, fuck it. It is what it is. That shit hurt, though. Nigga had two strokes. And I'm like, what the fuck? Yeah, I'm here. Yeah. Yeah. 28. Yeah. What about you? What you got? 20. Man, my life changed the moment, man. I had to say losing close relative. Right. Even most of the young age, though. And they right. told me, right. goddamn, you know what I'm saying? Live to die, you know what I'm saying? Instead of dying to live. Right. Because a lot of niggas, you know what I'm saying? To elaborate, a lot of niggas only work to pay bills and shit, you know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? Like, you alive, but you ain't living. So, so I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go fast because I got a lot to talk about. Because I ain't talking about it. I ain't gonna lie, I was thinking about what you said. But you know what I'm saying? That's the main one, though. Losing people. That was Destiny back when we was little, bro. Losing people, bro. Young age. She died as a young age. Definitely got no age, bro. Seeing her in that casting, bro, I was like, what the fuck? Like, we was kids, bro. Like, when yeah. I see her, I'm like, damn, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, she, you get off the same bus, you know what I'm saying, playing outside. I'm like, damn, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, yeah. Like, this could be me. Yeah. Like, I'm this like, damn. Be, you know what I'm saying? Like this could said, be me type yeah. shit. Yeah. Most definitely. Yeah, like, I'm going to piggyback on what he said, man. Look, I ain't a lot to you with shit. I'm the oldest down there of my little generation of growing up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I got people in front of me that'll follow me and type shit. See, you know, uh, teaching motherfuckers below you, bro. Teach them the right way. Don't leave them to no bullshit, you know what I'm saying? I lost my partner on some dumb shit, you And then he wouldn't have did it if I ain't, you know what I'm saying? Show them some flower shit. Yeah, like yeah. I did, you feel me? So, yeah. Teach them, man. Don't, don't, don't let them follow. You see them follow them, man. Pick them up. Let them know what's right and what's wrong. Man. I mean, granted, at the end of the day, they're going to make their own decision, man. but yeah, you, you put it out there. Shit, you yeah. did your point. Yeah. You put it out there. You gave them that information. Man, look, hey, be helpful to the people around you in your environment, man. Let's be the change, man. Be a part of the bullshit. You know what I'm My life changing moment was uh, when I got diagnosed with a um, critical autoimmune disease that could really take your life. So it made me pretty much put being happy 
first and not just always worry about money and succeeding with the materialistic things. It's all about family now and making memories. So it was a life changing moment for me. Back to me. Nice. Well, I already know what you want to say. What I'm about to say. Come on, tell me what I'm about to say. Come on, go ahead. Come on, come on. Can't speak All right. Come on. So, mine was when I got shot. <laughs> right. <laughs> I was in a thousand miles per hour. I was always working, 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 working. I don't even think I was a good mother. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I was just working. I was taking care. I was paying the bills, making sure the kids were fed. I was doing what I was supposed to be. Shit, I was the only parent at the time. I ain't never been a single mother before. So she, my main thing was I ain't want to be homeless. So I worked. I worked. I worked. I worked. I worked. Um, but when I got shot, because when I was in, I was going to Louisiana every weekend, and shit, I was doing hell. And these motherfuckers, I had to realize. I remember half telling me, half and Missy telling me, hey man. Because I remember I went home one time and I passed the fuck out. Like literally, ambulance had to be called. And went to the hospital. These niggas said, man, you working for these people, they don't give a fuck about you like this. You just a hairstylist. To them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was like, man, I don't know, bro. Because I was, I was putting everybody before my kids, everybody before me. You know what I'm saying? They was like, man, and if you ain't healthy, then how the fuck you gonna be healthy enough to do somebody else's hair? And I was like, man, I still ain't like, looking at it like she. But life had to teach me. So I remember mama used to always, every time I go home on the weekend, she'd be like, Nisi, let's let's do something together. Let's do something together. Let's do something together. Let's do something together. I'm like, man, all right, mama, all right, mama, all right. But my main thing was to work, 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 work. Because I didn't want to be homeless. So shit, when I got shot, shit, after that, I cut off Louisiana. I said, hey, I ain't doing hell no more. Shit, I'm Houston homebound. And when I did that, life was on the up and up. I was able to get that money. People was able to understand who I was out there. Clientele went up through the roof. I was able to spend more time with my mama, spend more time with family, period. The kids, you know what I'm saying? I was able to get a house. All that good stuff, so it's shit. Low. I just had to let understand, like, like this say. Hey, so <laughs> you, let me know when you're ready, right? So, so my life changed. And listen, I'm gonna tell y'all. I'm gonna keep it in TV with y'all, right? So, at 13 years old, cuz 13 years old, you gotta become a fucking man at 13 years old. Yeah. This is before I even had a kid. My mom. Oh, you wasn't had a kid. I was 14 when I was a kid. A year later, my mom and Dukes go to the same asylum, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? My my oldest brother, the nigga that I look up to, because my daddy, I ain't never met this nigga. All I know is my big brother, my mama, and my two younger brothers later on. You know what I'm yeah. saying? This nigga go to jail for life, 20 years, black. You know what I'm saying? So I don't know nothing else. You know what I'm saying? My mom dude's gone, she's shaking, rocking and shit. All I know is to take care of my little ones. You know what I'm saying? The niggas is under me, 13 years old. And then I'm also a, 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 a five-star athlete. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I'm smart. I got straight A's. All I know is school and sports. I was a nerd back then. Point next, if you want to call me. You know what I'm saying? A, 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 a fucking squat. That's all I know. But I, I grew up in the streets. You know what I'm saying? Everybody in that motherfucker know I can fight good. You know what I'm saying? I can play sports. I'm fast than a motherfucker. I can dunk on a motherfucker. I'm tall. Everybody know it. I'm taller than everybody. All y'all motherfuckers, I'm tall. So I was always, out, you know what I'm saying? I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a thorn. You know, I stick out more than any people. So it, it's like it, I'm drawn to the streets more. Motherfuckers see me like an adult because I'm taller than the younger motherfuckers. Right, right. And I'm, all, I'm, I'm, I'm the same height as older motherfuckers. But long story short, you know what I'm saying? So it was like I had to step up and become something that I wasn't. My nigga, I had a crackhead teach me how to sell dope. A crackhead. Can you imagine having a crackhead teach you how to sell dope? They know how to, they do it, so that's a good teacher. Yeah, he taught me how to cook dope. Cause I stole it from another nigga. I jugged for <laughs> I stole it from the nigga that was on the block. He was, I ain't gonna say the name because he yeah, couldn't yeah, yeah, right. But I stole it from another nigga on the block and then me and my partner, and we fucked up with a couple bets like, damn, this shit ain't coming up. This ain't no crack. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? But he showed me how to, you know what I'm saying? And then I got humble. Right. 
I got humble. Cause that shit, it, it fought it in your face when you know how that, you never hear somebody fuck around that shit stink so bad to where you like, man, get the fuck, I gotta move around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I had to move around. And I met my wife, right. which wasn't my wife at that time, but I, I met my wife. And then I go through this situation where it's a transition away from my own mama, my family, my, my little brothers and shit to where I'm building my own. And now I got, I got, I got, I got two kids already that I didn't start it. You know what I'm saying? Before yeah, I even yeah, met yeah. her. And then, later on down the line, how, what happens when you lose her? The person that kept you and all these two kids together, and now you got four kids by yourself. And you ain't got nobody to help you with this. Now, but back up a little bit. You just had a motorcycle accident and it took your motherfucking life. Right, right. How old were you? I was 25. Yeah. I was 25, 26, I'm sorry, 26 when I had a motorcycle accident and and I lost my life. And just like Terry will say, when you have a stroke, that makes you realize who you really are, how hard you can fight for your life because you can't do much, you can't move too much. He had a stroke where his body, that means that one side of your body ain't working the right way it's supposed to work and you can't do, now you got somebody else to wait on you. Just imagine having a motherfucking motorcycle accident where you can't move none of your body. You can't even wipe yourself when you take a shit. Wow, bro. Like, Man, my whole right side, nigga. From my neck all the way down to my motherfucking feet, I can't move nothing. I'm in a full body cast. Neck in two spaces on both sides. Rotator cuff, collarbone, motherfucking me, backbone. Motherfucking ribs punks in my lungs on both sides. Right side broken though. Pelvis bone, hip bone, femur bone. Plantar fascia. All your hands. Look at this. The whole fucking hand was moved over to the left. It was moved. Shifted. I can show you pictures. You can upload it later. I'll send them to you. But guess what? All that shit. You know what I'm saying? Now you still dealing with this shit. Right? How about... How about a year and a half later, you got to bury the motherfucker that's taking care of all four of your kids? You understand what I'm saying? Your lifeline. The person that you became, that you made a part of you. That made, you know how, how they say, they say your wife is who is the image of you? Yeah. Or, your, or the, your better half is the, is the image you face, they face you. Front right. and back. You know what I'm saying? If I leave, she can still do what I do. If she leave, I can still do what she do. You lose that. Now, outside of this person that you just lost, that's the spin image of you. You got somebody that's gonna follow you all the way up into the point where you at. This is my little brother. He helped me put my wife in the ground. And a few months later, he died. We talk about life changing moments. You know what I'm saying? And you stand on that shit. You know what I'm saying? You stand on it and everybody asks you, why you can't cry? Why you ain't doing what you're doing? When the hurt so fucking bad to where you want to kill yourself more than you want to kill a person that did this shit? You understand? And you can't touch them motherfuckers? And you can't touch them motherfuckers? It's like, it's eating from the inside on out. And every time you got to go back to this same nothing ass city, that took everything that you love away from you. You know what I'm saying? That's yeah. like a black hole. And people wonder what a fucking black hole it is. They say it's the universe <laughs> sucking some shit in. Yeah, for real. No, that black hole is your fucking mental, your mind. This is it right here. Sucking itself in. Back and forth. It's bringing back that same demon that you don't want to come out to show everybody that he's a motherfucking yeah. devil. You know what I'm saying? For real. But you gotta put this face on to show the world that you still happy. you still you you still Ooh. happy. Ooh. You know what I'm saying? Because guess what? I got four beautiful butterflies and I'm trying to make motherfucking me well caterpillars that I'm trying to make into butterflies. So so I'm trying to mold them into the person that I want them to be that I think that they they mama want them to be. You know what I'm saying? What I'm saying? So at the same time, like I say, Christmas ain't the same no more. New Year's ain't the same no more. You know what I'm saying? Your life ain't the same no more. I can build with somebody else. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I can build with a totally different person. But that hurt still there. 
You know what I'm saying? Because it evolves around the same situation. I lost my life, but I'm still here. Why the fuck would you bring me back? Why the fuck would you let me live? Why would you let me still walk knowing the shit that I did, that I know? You know what I'm saying? And it's a different topic. I know it's off topic, but I know it's a different topic. But I know that I'm not going to heaven. I did too much. Too much to too many people to see the same people that I want to love and, and, and cherish in heaven. You know what I'm saying? Got a lot of time I do got a lot. Of, I've been trying. Yeah, it, it's true. But at the same time, it's like, damn. They done watch this shit. They see this shit. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. But at the same token, that that changes your life. When you say life changing, right. you know what I'm saying? That's generational change. You know what I'm saying? That changed my kids for something. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That changed no. everything. I ain't that fast no. anymore. That's why I slowed my life down to try to see if I can see it from a different view to make me understand what's going on. Right. Right. You know what I'm saying? But it, it, that that's my life changing thing that people see. Like, damn, man, you still strong, bro. You so strong. I, it ain't that I'm strong. Because I hurt every day. I'm numb. Mm -hmm. I'm numb. Now, outside of that, I, I just named I just named two people. Right. We lost Bull. Yeah, well, yeah. We sure. lost Bull. You know what I'm saying? Long little Bull. We lost, we lost Tukey, my little nephew, slash cousin. You understand? We lost my uncle. You know what I'm saying? I lost my pops too. You know what I'm saying? My grandma. Right. All in the span of one year. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Life is a motherfucker. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And, and people wonder why why you smile and why you sit alone and why you do what you do. But life goes on. You know what I'm saying? You got to yeah. understand that. You living, you living for right now. You not living for back then. You not living for tomorrow. You live every day like it's the next day. You know what I'm saying? Like tomorrow's not promised. You plant, you plant whatever feet you got. You dig that motherfucker deep as you can in the dirt and motherfucking push hard as you can and go to the next motherfucking step. Because if you don't, we all you see what shit perish behind or besides. Because everybody can't go. I can't take all y'all with me. I can hold on as tight as I can, but guess what? I might lose him tomorrow. I might lose you tomorrow, God, when I don't want to. I might lose me tomorrow. And y'all gotta push farther than me. I'm just I'm just building the next stone for you to step up on to get past me. You know what I'm saying? Or you to pass me or me to pass you. So at the end of this podcast, you know that hey, this is a family talk. This is family podcast. You feel me? This is family. This is all we got. You know what I'm saying? I got a question, dude. Talk to me. I know, like, whenever kids lose a parent, it's like a touchy subject. Have you, like, how long did it take you to actually sit down and have that talk with your kids so, to see how they felt about it? Then, so my kids, so so my kids, my kids, it's not it's not so much of a touchy subject because of the fact that my kids had to deal with with my little brother dying. You know what I'm saying? Outside of their mother dying right before him dying. You know what I'm saying? Then they have to deal with bull dying right before their mother died. You know what I'm saying? And so it's it's not it's not so much of a touchy, touchy subject on their mother because you will always wanna feel your mama's want or your father's want. You know what I'm saying? I can't tell you how to hurt. You're gonna hurt on your own, regardless. But we gonna always talk about the good times, because it ain't nothing but good times to you. You ain't gonna remember the bad times when somebody gone. You ain't gonna remember how we fought. Robert told me, man, my bike fucked up and rusted in your backyard. You know what I'm saying? You gonna remember about, damn, Dix can't help me pick my shit up off the side of the road. Flames coming out of that motherfucker. He didn't let my shit rust though. He didn't let it rust though. <laughs> but he gonna remember though, he gonna remember how we came and lived with that bitch up. But see, that's a whole different subject, but at the same time, though, it's a subject in his own self, but it's depression ain't nothing. Yeah, I mean, you got to find it. Listen, wait a minute. No, wait, wait. This is how I see it, right? Everybody if you in the Sahara Desert, right? And you'd have been in the military, and you would have been in the Sahara Desert, right? If you were in the Sahara Desert, right? And you would have been in the military, and you over there in the heat, and you ain't got no water, what's the first thing you dream about? Water. Right? That's what you want. Right? Yeah. And that's what it is. So, back back in the gap. Have you ever had depression back in the gap? 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Listen, hey, yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Just think about it, man. I mean, wait, I'm wait. So, 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 so I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say, <laughs> hell yeah, we all had depression way back then, but we didn't recognize and understand it. Right, right, right. We, we didn't understand and recognize what it was in front of us. Until you, now, but so see. But you yeah, made it. Yeah. You so made now depression is like, mother like, are oh, you depressed? And we gonna look at you like, nah, I'm just going through something. Right. Through it, exactly. Like, so, see, so, so, so wait. So until somebody put light on it saying that it's depression, well, you, mind, yeah. you yeah. never knew that it was depression. Like he was saying it's a black hole, man. It's a black fucking hole. It's so <laughs> depression, the depression part comes in. This is what my idea of depression is. Depression is you wallowing in the bullshit that you can't fix. Right. Right. It's spill right. milk. You, you know, right. spill milk. I'm sorry, I said mix, but spill milk. <laughs> you can't fix that. You know what I'm saying? I can't bring her back. I'm not God. I can't motherfucking feed a nation with fish. You know what I'm saying? I can't I can't break bread for everybody around this motherfucker. I can't do that. That's you know what, what some people are cause some people actually deal with the product. They don't know why they in the dark hole. They don't yeah, know why they, they feel how they feel. But, but they don't know why. But you know why they don't know why? It's because people, exactly, and people put their own stuff onto you to make you feel like, okay, so now you programmed to know that, man, I'm just depressed. I don't, I don't feel like doing this here today. I don't, I don't want to do this today. You ain't got nobody to kick yourself in the ass and say, hey, I got to do this. I got to stand on me. I got to be me. I got to be the strongest me that I can be. And, and that's the way that I feel that they're, they're losing Everybody that I lost around me, you know what I got to do? Don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong. I cry like a baby. Oh, in, in, my own, in my own spare time, at certain times, I can be in the car listening to a certain song. I it's going to always be in the back of your head that, damn, this is the song that me and, me and you know what I'm saying? This is, this is shit that we used to do. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to tell you off right now. But at the end of the day, it's like, it's like, I got these, I got these, these four people that, that I got to, I got to get, I got to be strong for. You know what I'm saying? Now, not just these four people I gotta be strong for, right? When I go around my mind, dudes, it's Christmas time. My brother died seven days before Christmas. You know what I'm saying? So, when I go around my mind, dude, I gotta stand strong for her, too. When I go around my auntie, I gotta stand strong for her, too. Who's standing strong for me? That's the hard part. You know what I'm saying? They go back to that black hole. I'm sucking myself in to push out for everybody else. You understand what I'm saying? So depression is a mind state. Everybody know that. Everybody knows it's a mind state. But it's your own mind state. I can't stay there. I gotta live life. What, what you say? How you say it? Exactly. So guess what? If I live to die and die and die to live, that means that I know. I know that I'm going one time, or as they say, the Bible say. I'm going to see them again. If I if I walk this path, right? But me, on the other hand, <laughs> I did some shit. That's unbearable. But he said, if you forgive me, I, I'm hoping that he will. That, you know, if I he asks for forgiveness. Exactly. So, that again, that so that, that brings back that same spirit. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a be on my I'm gonna be on my ass and cry about them every day. You know what I'm saying? In my mind, I'm gonna do that. And, and to answer your question, my kids cope with it, but I know they're not over it. They'll never be over. Right. My, uh, my baby girl, anything that triggers or say something about her mama, she goes in a cocoon, which is her room. Can't get out of. You can't talk to her. You can't do nothing. My 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 other one. Mm-hmm. Which is her mother. She don't know what I know. She tried to sneak a little bottle of alcohol because her mom used to drink. Mm-hmm. And want to be just like her mom. You know what I'm saying? She want to be the loud mom. She want to be the party. You know, she want to be that person. But she headstrong just like her mom. So it don't let her allow her to be drunk or do what she do because she's headstrong. Because she got both of us in her. You know what I'm saying? And that's the part of her mom. The military part. That I got to drive and be better. I got to be better than the rest of my siblings. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? My son and my other oldest daughter that is not even a part of my wife. Mm-hmm. But she raised them since they was infants, two years old, seven months old. You know what I'm saying? So they know her as mama. Mm-hmm. Same way. Same outcome. Everything is always the same. So what footprint you give to your child, you pregnant right now. Mm-hmm. That footprint you give, it live a legacy. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Just the same way I got mad when he said he ain't had nobody to look up to. My nigga. <laughs> I'm the epitome of fucking legacy. You know what I'm saying? 
<laughs> I'm the fucking epitome of legacy, nigga. It ain't not one nigga that you know that came out the motherfucking slums. They're still by their children. All four of them from birth to motherfucking death do us part. Like we married. All right, you you gonna fall? You gonna edit this out? He okay. The reason he said y'all watch the thing, he was saying he does not look up at anybody because there's someone he wants to be like. He wants to do better than everyone he's seen come up yeah, before him. But that's my son. Yeah, that's my son. So he feel the same way I feel. So but, you mad? But, yeah, but he gonna look at this and that. He might be over there playing for sleep, but he, he understands. But yeah. I, like I said, I'm the epitome of that shit yeah. because I raised four kids. From 14 years old to motherfucking 37 like I am right now. You know what I'm saying? I ain't never seen I sacrificed. I was a D1 motherfucking scholarship scout, nigga, for every goddamn college. Texas Longhorns, OU, motherfucking me, Florida State. I was there. You know what I'm saying? But guess what? His mom gonna stab me in my goddamn chin. Fuck up all my ligaments and shit. God, Shout man. out to the corner, Joseph. No, he didn't. <laughs> <laughs> but, but yeah, but, but long, long story short, you know what I'm saying? I can still could have did it, but, but long story short, I could have did it, you know what I'm saying? But I chose to go and be a man instead of there. I had to go work a job. I wanted to make sure my kids didn't have what I had. You know what I'm saying? A daddy that didn't care about his son. You know what I'm saying? They didn't care about what... I met my daddy three times my entire life. Yeah. I met him... The first time I met him, I was yeah, 14 years old. Picture, man. Like, 20, you know what I'm saying? And, and, and I didn't even know who he was. My dad, my mama had to tell me, you know who this dude is? No, I don't know this dude. This your dad. I ain't got no daddy. I don't know this nigga. That's my exact word. Excuse my name, is Cameron, but I don't know this nigga. The second time I met him, he was on his deathbed in the hospital. He wanted me to sign some papers saying that I was his son so I can get his benefits. And I'm 18 years old. Nigga, I ain't getting them but one month of this shit. You know what I'm saying? And then the next time I seen him, I put him in the ground. And I met my grandmother for the first time. And I walked in there and she told me, y'all lied to me, my son right there. Because she thought that I was her son because I looked just like him. How hurtful is that? That's that cold. You understand what I'm saying? That's cold. My life is a motherfucking movie. Nigga, I'm better than 50 cents. <laughs> Shout out to G Unit. They did come to Louisiana. Do y'all feel like that makes a difference yeah. for males like growing up with the father? Yeah, with yeah, the yeah. active father and growing up down? Yeah, yeah, make a difference. And guess what? My son ain't never been. I'm going to tell you why. I'm going to use your example. It's Carla. Yeah, fast, fast. So, I mean, you look at all three of them. And I'm going to continue to that point. But, 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 I know you hold on, hold on, because it, it, it takes a village to raise children and a child. Yeah, but yeah. if you talking about an independent woman who raised kids that I seen in my life, Miss Carla, well, and she did it with three boys. But she didn't have Papa Joe and Ronnie, though. Hold she on, she, nah, but to an extent. But on an everyday <laughs> basis. Did, but did, did, but did, on an everyday <laughs> basis. Like, yeah, she did the same thing. Hold on, let me finish. She had Rodney to to come, and yeah, Rodney had, look, I get him right, but do every 24 hours a day, it was them three. And then when Rod got old enough, yeah, like, about when saying, Rod got old enough, then Rod stepped up yeah, and, and that Rod, But that's why, that's why, yeah, but that's right. why I'm about saying but, that. But, 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 but Ms. Carla, yeah, you, if we know Ms. Carla, yeah. then you wouldn't even question because how the type of woman she was. Perfect. So you see this, you like, so yes, it does make a difference, but it depends on that woman. Yeah. It solely depends on that woman. Yeah. So Wait, that's why I'm talking. I mean, what? I mean, I, I mean, I heard, I understand everything you said. The question was, do you think it's a man of two household parents better than just one? No, does it, it, does it make no, a, does it make a difference yeah, like, okay. for a male to have saying, a male figure in his life and not? Yeah, okay. Not, 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 yeah. But we know what I teach. Yeah, we know what I teach. Yeah, yeah, but he did have a two-parent yeah, yeah, house. Yeah, but you don't know what off it. The question would be, not just. Having a dad, having a male figure. Yeah, yeah. 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 It's a difference. Yeah. That's what I was you hit it on the head. Like, yeah, Auntie did a shit to Rod got to that point. We know what our right. Rod sacrificed. Right. Shit, there okay. was that father figure. Right. So okay. that what made the difference and led us on that path. Led right. them on that path. So right. that most definitely made a difference. No, I can't. I can't listen. I can't knock. I see that I did it by myself. 
But then I did it with my stepdaddy. But then my stepdaddy was not that that he was Sir. a he was a male in the household, yeah. but he wasn't a male figure, a role figure. model right, figure. Right, right. Because guess what? Bro, when I was 12 years old, I beat my stepdaddy up. Right. Yes, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, like it wasn't no. Don't get me wrong now. My stepdaddy was that nigga on the block. You feel what I'm saying? Like he was the top. He was the top nigga. Yeah, yeah. The nigga was big. He was a crip. The nigga that went to jail. He been in and out of jail. The nigga big as fuck. But you know what I'm saying? Now at the same time, you put your hands on my mama. We gotta fight. You know what I'm saying? I'm old enough and I'm tall enough. I'm big enough. I want to try you too. You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, though, all you taught me was the streets. In the beat women, in the streets. You know what I'm saying? What I'm saying? Now you gave me everything. I hit all the all the flies joints. I hit all the all the newest games and shit. But that ain't showing me how to be a man. Right. That's showing me right. how to live in the struggle. Right. Right. You know what I'm saying? What I'm saying? My, we had to discuss the other day. My kids, what you say?